Welcome to the demo of Paint Swatches, a paint color organizer and specification tool. To get started, let's open the product, and you will be taken right to an Add Project screen. Here you can add any customized project name you would like, but today we are going to add Dining Room. Once that's done, you'll see it in your list of projects. To add another one, simply click the Add Project button. But today we're going to go play with some color. Here you take it to the next screen where you'll have a palette bar across the top and a workspace. As soon as you add, find a color you like, when you click on it to add color, you'll see it in the palette bar. Let's go find some colors. There's multiple ways to search for colors. You can search the name or the number in the search bar. You can scroll through the colors on the screen. Today, we are just going to see And there's Barrier Reef from California Paints, and we're going to add it to our project. Do another search, but let's do a broader search for a brown. That will pull up any color that has the word brown in it. And we're going to add Weathered Brown to our project. And for our next search, go back in there and let's do a scroll. And let's choose and add this one to our project. Now in order to add a trim color, maybe we'll look in a different manufacturer. And we'll just search white. And we'll add that one to our project. And let's add, search a green. And and let's add one more color so we have enough colors to play with on our workspace. Uh, again, you can see the full line of choices. If you choose a color and you want to see the next color, you simply scroll your finger across the screen and you'll be brought to the next color. And we're going to scroll through until we see something we are looking for. And peony pink. Let's add that one to the project. Okay, now you have all your colors in your palette bar, and as you scroll across, you'll see them all. To add them to the workspace, simply click on them. Sometimes you might want to represent a bigger color, color for your one swatch. It might be your main wall color. Simply add two boxes and you can make a bigger one. Okay, and we can move these about the screen. And then see if we want a little brighter color for an accent color or a softer color. I think we will go for a brighter color. In order to take this color swatch off your screen, Simply lift it above the palette bar, bar and let it go and it will disappear back into the palette bar. In order to delete it from the palette bar, you hit the Edit Palette button and we will find it, Peony Pink, Reverse Swipe and Delete and it will disappear and you will also see it's gone from your palette bar. Now here we get a list and this shows you all the colors you've used in your workspace. Here we have three California paints and two bear paints, and that will tell you the name and the color number. We have notes. Here we might want to add in room dimensions. That way when you go to the paint store, you can talk to whoever's working about your size of your room, and they can give you the amount, right amount of quantity of paint that you need to buy. Hit done when you're done. And you can bring an email screen up. You add who it's to. Your subject will always be your project name. It'll give you a list of all the colors you've used in your workspace. And it'll bring up your notes, all ready to be emailed to a client, a customer, a family member, or a new homeowner, anyone that you might need to send this to. Once you can cancel that, you can bring back to your project screen. And that's it. Thank you for watching our demo.